This video provides in-depth discussion about the effect of HTPE system on leaf-footed bugs using data from laboratory studies. Basic principles of the HTPE system along with producer observations has been described in part one of this series. Mention of company names and products does not mean an endorsement. Shade cloths are sold by many vendors online or in store. Producers should consult the authors for more information and check with local suppliers. The lock stitch say cloth shown here have wide openings and provides a range of pest exclusion at a relatively low cost. The monofilament shade cloth manufactured by FarmTech has fine openings. All these models have an opening at the bottom for introducing vegetables to attract leaf-footed bugs for behavioral observations. Ten leaf-footed bugs released in each model and immediately covered with a glass cage. Insects entering the high tunnel models were recorded at 8, 24, and 48 hours. Experiments were replicated three times. The HTPE system can significantly reduce leaf-footed bug feeding on vegetables. In laboratory studies, these insects can be seen exploring the outer surface of a 50% knitted fabric and fail to reach the crop inside. Crops in open fields can be devastated by these insects, resulting in poor produce quality. There were significant differences in the movement of leaf-footed bugs due to the shade cloths. A 40 and 50% knitted shade cloth from Tolitex or Greentech significantly reduced pest access to okra inside the models. A 30% shade cloth was not able to stop the leaf-footed bugs. We had mixed success with tests involving green beans. For example, a 40% shade cloth from Tolitex was not significantly different in protecting green beans at 48 hours compared to untreated check. One consistent result from this study was the total exclusion of bugs from the 50% knitted shade cloth, which is similar to earlier findings with okra. FarmTech sunblocker shade cloths were very effective in blocking leaf-footed bugs. However, these monofilament materials can also significantly reduce natural enemy movement, as explained in the third video. Extensive leaf-footed bug feeding causes rapid darkening of okra and irregularities on the fruit surface. A 50% shade cloth is adequate for pest exclusion that results in crop quality improvement. A number of vegetable producers are finding significant crop improvement by stopping leaf-footed bugs and stink bugs. Producers interested in the pest exclusion must familiarize themselves about the target pest species and then consider materials carefully. Full research data and information summarized in this video can be found in several journal articles and extension bulletins. You can also find additional insect pest pictures and videos on our Facebook. Always contact your extension agent for a detailed discussion on pest exclusion technology before using it full scale as there may be other IPM options best suited to your farm.